<laughs> Let's go. Let's go. 78. 78. Oh my fucking god. Can I show titties on stream? Let's go. Let's go. 78. 78. Oh my fuck. Well, 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 guys, this is probably the worst way to start out the year 2024, but man, hackers and cheaters are getting caught left and right on Twitter. It's ridiculous, bro. So let me tell you guys about this story. It was, oh, it just happened last week. This happened like around December 29th or 30th. I forgot which day it was, but it was hilarious to see because this streamer was twerking and he got caught cheating in the game. I was like, what the hell? This is just freaking hilarious. You set up like the worst image of yourself to against, like to show up to others, bro. This is like the worst way to do it. So uh, anyways, so this guy, you know, named Divinity, this, this streamer, this wager player, I don't care what he is, but you know, this player, he got caught, you know, hacking and he was just getting called out. He was exposed. He was like, man, Modern Warzone called him out. CharlieIntel.com, you know, all these people on Twitter were going at him, bro. Like, he's canceled. He's done. So, uh, his response, you guys want to see his response? You guys want to know what his response was about this he whole situation? was not cheating before. I'm just going to say that right now. I'm going to be honest. I bought them on the 29th, yesterday. I bought them yesterday. Yeah, and I don't want to throw anyone under the bus but i asked someone you probably know who um how to set it up okay i lost in finals three fucking times yesterday on warzone so i got mad i got mad and i never set them up i don't know how to do the settings i don't know what the fuck i was doing and he actually paid for it so basically he had intentions of cheating in the game regardless of how much excuses he used he wanted to cheat. He was intending to cheat. And I know a lot of people are going to say like, well, how much was the wager? It was $34. He cheated for $34, bro. That's good enough for gas, right? And I know some players out there are going to say like, well, it's just $34. Why do you even worry about it? Like, bro, people are going to think that he's good and he could get invitations to bigger tournaments that are like worth $1,000 or more. And there you go. He's just stealing money left and right. He's making money for free while cheating. And he paid for those cheats. I'm not sure how cheats cost, how much they cost, but he made some money back. <laughs> so, um, I mean, I will be pissed. If I were to reach the finals and it was for $1,000 and I had to face this dude named Divinity and knowing that he cheats and he wins the match, he gets the money? Bro, no. <laughs> I would love to punch that guy in the face. I'm like, dude, like, nah, you ain't right, bro. You ain't right in the head. So, um, this is ridiculous, man. I don't know why people do this, to be honest. You can just practice in the game, play, play over and over and over again. It doesn't take that much. It's an online game. It's an online game. If you have a job, if you have some things to take care of your home, take care of them. Take care of your family, bro. In the first place, I'm not going to say, like, oh, make time for the game. Like, like, no, make time for your family, bro. Like, touch grass, shit, dude. Especially if you have to cheat. So, um, I know what people are going to say. Well, Joe, Joe, you know, it was just 34 bucks. It was just 34 bucks. It doesn't matter. <laughs> He's just a wager player. He's a small timer. Like I said, it could go bigger. It could go way bigger than that. And you guys are going to regret saying that type of stuff. So, uh, so yeah, guys, my thoughts are do not cheat. Simple as that. You don't have to cheat. You really don't. Just get better at the game. That's it. <laughs> just accept it, bro. Like, this is what some of the top players got to accept. Sometimes people can actually beat you. They can be better than you. All right. And you're not the best at all times. I learned that since like Modern Warfare 3, the original, because it was a super laggy game. And I was in my prime in Black Ops 1. I was a beast. I was literally ranking the top 15 in the whole world in both domination team deathmatch. And man, did I get humbled in Modern Warfare 3. It was a whole different story. Like You just got to learn, right? It just takes time. I know these people gotta like fall onto earth at one point, but they never will because they're just stuck in this in this like cloud of imagination <laughs> that they're the best in the game. So it kind of sucks, bro. That we're never gonna be able to convince it. 
So, um, anyways, those are my thoughts about these type of things. You know, cheaters running rampant in Call of Duty. What is there to do about them? Just a straight up ban, or should Call of Duty just start finding them because they're actually changing the way that people are playing the game? So, I don't know. Just, just, just my thoughts. Just quick thoughts, you know. So, um, anyways, uh, the gameplay's not over yet. So, I guess we'll talk about the gameplay real quick. This happened on my last live stream of Modern Warfare 3, and this was actually the first time I used Attack V, by the way. So, uh, I ended up getting 61 kills. If you guys want to see that gameplay, just go through my last live stream of Modern Warfare 3 and you'll be able to see that, like, how many kills I got with it. It was insane. It was fun. It was fun to use this weapon because it was strong as hell, you know, as compared to the regular assault rifles, Attack V is a beast. I used to use this one back in Modern Warfare 2, so. So that is it, guys. Leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what's up, and I'll see you guys in the next one.